Hello guys, today I'm starting my new channel, playing Minecraft Pocket Edition, it's a survival let's play. Man, oh man, there are so many mobs and this is not a good spawn. Let's try to kill this. I'm, I have set split controls on because I play with split controls. You can see this plus sign. That means it's the split control is on. Okay. I'm trying to find trees now. Dude, no trees. Huh, sheep. Oh, I need sheep. We'll need to craft a bed, so I'm trying to get sheep. You can see some mobs are burning. They are bad mobs. Some bad mobs burn in the, in the daylight. We'll need to kill these for food. Look, it dropped food. We need sheep for bed. Let's get some. Look, it's burning. These are skeletons. They'll shoot you with the bow if you are too close. I'll make the basic things for today. Like, look, they all die automatically in the daylight. I'll make the basic things like bed. And stone tools and furnace trees drop sticks and saplings oh man I'm out of sprint If your hunger bar goes down, you are not able to run fast. You can run fast if you double click on the on the the front button. If your hunger bar goes down too low, you will lose health. So it's always necessary to Fill your hunger bar. Another sheep. Now we can make a bed after killing it. Okay, three wool. We need three wool and wood planks to make a bed. Oh man. Now we'll craft. Look. When you go in your inventory, this is a button. When you click on these buttons, you will see what you can craft. We can cla uh, craft wood planks. A crafting table is very necessary, so craft it. You will need sticks for, for tools. Place the crafting table, click on it. Look, we can craft a bed now. I'll need a pickaxe because with a pickaxe we can mine stone. You can see that if I mine stone, we'll get cobblestone. It's a basic feature of the game. You will need a silk touch to get the real stone. Or, or you have to smelt the stone. Now I can craft a furnace. Look, a furnace. With the furnace, you can cook stuff. Uh, I'm using planks because I don't have coal for now.
it also shows you what what will be co uh, what will be be the final thing that is and uh, that has come after look when i eat this my hunger bar is so high i'll show you another feature of a bed that for that we'll need a flower ah oh, i took damage there are yellow flowers white is not useful look red and blue i'm gonna make a blue bed when you break a flower you can make a dye with the flower my furnace and stuff there they are look blue dye have to sleep or the mobs will come and kill us blue bed okay now it's daytime i think my co food is ready after taking it you can put it, take it back this stuff uh, a stone sword a stone axe you can put the stuff in your inventory by going in this chest option you can replace stuff like this I'll put the stuff that I don't need at the moment. You'll get the stuff you place. Look cool. Oh man, my health is low. With coal, you can cook stuff in the furnace. It is like a fuel. You can also use wood if you don't ha get f uh, coal, but it's, there's a basic ore in the game. You get it after some time if you mine. Look, a lot of coal. It is the most simple thing. Simple ore in the game. Look, I got 17 coal. And when you go here, you can make torches. You can use the coal to cook stuff in the furnace. Now I'm gonna get some. Look, it's a one shot now. There are horses too, but you need saddles to ride them. If you kill the small chickens, you'll not get anything. Let's go in that direction. If you jump sprint, you can sprint by double clicking. We'll see if we can find something or I'll end the, the video for now. For today, I've shown you how to craft, craft the basic things. In the next video, I'll show you guys much more and many more things how to craft them. It's a small problem. You can also find ravines 
with their uh, big cracks in the the look we found a ravine i was just telling about it look these are big cra cracks in the the ground which can lead to level 11. look iron that yellow look this this is iron you can make better tools with it you can also find diamonds by going down at that at level 11 look at the top left corner and and corner there is position which are my coordinates and there you can see there is 64 or 10 if it will be level 11 look at this ravine you can find find diamonds if you go down look at the 64 written in the coordinate if it will be 11 when you go down you'll find and uh, look you will see that it is decreasing when it will be 11 you will get you might find diamonds but it is also a chance you have to mine for diamonds it can be anywhere in the stone look at it it's such a big ravine i'll end the video here